Hey guys, be on the new channel here with a new episode of Super Mario Galaxy 2. Last time, I don't know what we did. I still, I still can't feed that thing. That's a good level. We're gonna go to right side down. Just more of a one-off thing. And I do want to show something. Breaking the laws of gravity. Do 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 do. So basically. As you can probably see from this level, there's a lot of little interesting things in this uh, little level here. But the most interesting thing I'd like to show you... Actually, no, wait. Wait, 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 look at this. That's the most satisfying Goomba kill. Like, actually, no. It's the most satisfying kill. Look, just look at that in the entire game. You can get an even better one, anyway. We're going to do the secret mission first, which I believe, if memory serves right. And also, yes, Fire Mario. He's shaking you fire. Yes, this is it. This is the one. And as you can see, this may serve, if memory serves correct. Uh, I guess for the viewers, sorry. Make it! You didn't make it. Anyway. This is like the equivalent of the uh, the bombing one in Battle Rock and Dreadnought in the first game. Essentially, if you have no idea what I'm talking about, you have 20 seconds to break all these boxes. And I honestly thought, the first time I played this, that it was going to be an absolute nightmare. But just look at this. This There's this, this a really simple trick. You just walk out here, and you just start firing in lanes. It's a joke. Just look at that. I'm gonna finish with five seconds left. First try, there's no editing involved. Look at that. Just look at that. And there's the star. It's so simple. I don't know how it can justify. Anyway, see you guys in the next level. Oh, wait, before that. Bank Toad is here. Bank Toad's kind of important. He keeps your money, and he also stores things from different save files. Which means, because as you probably saw in the first episode, I have two more save files. He, uh, well, he keeps all my, uh, my star bits, which I've deposited in the bank in previous star and save files. Which means that you can essentially just cheese the entire game, because I have 8,444 from previous playthroughs. <laughs> I love that. I absolutely love that. Okay, so we're here. And that's... I was actually gonna cut to here, but... We didn't exactly make it that far. So essentially, flip switches thingies are the, the key here. Make it! Yeah, good job. Flip switches are the entire thing here, and you uh, either go up or down. Buddy. I stuck. Kaboom! That actually worked, the homing ground pound. Has a recoil. And. Just star bits in there, which I really do need, but I'm still going to ignore because I don't care. I just did a. Pro gamer move right there. Hit the switch again, and then gravity switches from proper from this perspective to upside down. Which is, I, 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 yeah, there is a way to. Um, I saw a video, Sugar Conroy actually, on his uh, hunt for. Oh god, on his hunt for. Well, I won't spoil it, but. I'm not gonna make it. God, okay. Where he actually uh, beat the entire level without any uh, assistance. Please go down, thank you very much. Here's our first checkpoint. Cotton Metal is right there, by the way. For anyone who didn't see it. Haha, -ha, fry. These boxes you can't uh, spin into. Anyone wondering? 
Haha. You can get a bit trigger happy with uh, <laughs> with the uh, the whole thing here. And this is kind of neat, but also a bit weird. You go from 2D axes to a 3D axes from a top-down perspective, which is kind of weird. Please make it. Yeah, another. Now we're fine. Another fun thing is uh, well, not really fun, but you can't really shake to like re reproject your momentum. I don't, I don't know. Just say anyway. Neat trick here. I learned much later is you uh, can do a backflip and you can actually maintain your entire. I'm not gonna go on there. You can actually maintain your uh, 3D quality and just skip throughout the level. Anyway, the star is right here. So just do a little ground pound. And that didn't work. Terrific. Anyway, it's probably fine. There you go. You're supposed to do that anyway. It's like a four-way gravity thing. We got the star. See you in the next level. And I have enough starburst to feed that thing now, I think. Do I? Yes, I do. Anyway, we're not going to go there quite yet. We're going to the best, the absolute best level of World 1, which I'm sure many people would agree with me. The Fluffy Bluff Galaxy. Search for the Toad Brigade Captain. Here is where we meet a new friend. It's not really a friend. And there is poor Captain Toad. Who's, is he using it? No, he gets one star for you. Yeah, he gets, he gets one star for you in this game. But... Which is, you're probably going to find this is going to be a really reoccurring thing with me, but we're actually going to do the secret level first. So, well, if you don't like it, sorry, I just like doing it first. And this is actually one of the hardest, this is the hardest thing in like up to world six right here. What I'm going to show you. I'm collecting a lot of coins, you can see, because... There are a fair amount. There's a, there's a, there's a coin hungry, but look at this. This is like a little bonus room where you get most of your coins from. The timing is just so tight on this. If you miss one of these things, oh god. Come on, you need 70 of the things. Make it! Yeah, good job. Alright, I've died in practice on those things, like, three times? Anyway, we're going to get a new power-up, which I haven't really explored much. It is the, uh, the Cloud Mario power-up. You just essentially jump and shake, and then you have a temporary platform in the form of a cloud. And it eventually falls apart. Click this. Actually, this is where you can get some other coins, too. And as you can see right there. Make it! Yeah! You have 114 coins, which is quite a lot. Considering in almost every single level of this game, you get like two coins. Anyway, he wants 100? Oh my god, never mind, I thought he wanted 70. There goes all the hard work. It's just that I'm so full. Wow, I think I'm gonna transform! Sorry if that. Sounded a bit too loud on on audio, but all right. As you can see, this thing actually no, you haven't seen this thing. It's a kind of a copy of a later thing. With just jump over it with one of the less exciting. You can essentially just skip almost everything here. Unlike the other one, which involves a much less practical power-up. Let's make it away to the top here. And ta-da! No, don't you dare do that. Ta-da, there's a star. And, alright. Alright, next star. Actually, time for the main mission of Fluffy Bluff. That was the secret mission. Every planet has its price. And now the search for the Toad Brigade Captain. And I want to show you guys a really cool um, planetary skip thing. 
coins are no longer a concern. This thing, I have no idea what it's called. But I hate, I hate its guts. And I can't hit it. There you go, stupid bird. It's almost as annoying as those chickens in the other world. There's a really neat skip I want to show you guys right here. Like, it, it's really neat. Don't fall off, please. So you go here, right? Make sure you have a cloud suit with you. And then... Do a long jump here. And I was actually quite surprised to hear about this one myself. But they're actually uh, there's they're solid things. Don't you dare try to hit me. It's actually quite quite the substantial skip. Now, in retrospect, I did miss the comet medal, so I'm gonna have to go back again for that. So that's bad, but if for whatever reason you don't care about the comet medals, which you really should, then do this skip. And there's the Toad Brigade Captain. It just essentially skipped half the level. Which brings me to my next point. This whole, um... This whole Let's Play here is not going to be a 100% um, helpful... I don't know. What do you call it? What's over here? This isn't going to be a 100%, you know detailed guide of every planet run through but it will help you get to the game should you actually choose to watch which i'd be very appreciative of and now with that being said we're going to meet this guy whoa it's your good work getting up here come with the chimp seems like you may be a worthy high climb rival take the star we'll talk later and there's the starter and there's also the planet we discovered in the background see you around yes yeah, you around this guy becomes quite annoying later. You got a star. I hate this thing. Okay, we're here for the comet medal. This is the proper way you're supposed to go. But I skipped with my pro gamer abilities. So you just you go up that hill thing which I carefully avoided. Get some star bits, which never really and there, as you can see, lo and behold, the Comet Medal, and also those things. Anyway, after you get this, you just go back to the main planet. I'll see you guys at the end. If he's finishing. I also never commented on how good the music was here. Pretty good. Oh yeah, and we also discovered this thing too, in addition to the common metal. It's a, I don't know what you call it. Oh, there it is, yeah, the cloud suit, I forgot. Look at that, I bet you act some kind of floaty souvenir, it's a cloud fire. There sure is some weird stuff out there, huh? There certainly is love, uh, game has been saved. Alright guys. That being said, we got the Comet Medal. Come on, make it in there. Don't go back in the hat. Make it in there. Okay. That being said, guys, we are... Excuse me. That being said, next time we're gonna... How many need? Seven? We have way more than enough. That being said, next time on Super Mario Galaxy 2, we're gonna feed this thing. Looks like you found a hungry Luma. Hope you got a stack of starbucks because those guys can eat. I do have enough. And that being said, guys, see you next time. We'll be feed this thing and continue our adventures on Super Mario Galaxy 2.